you launch an app from Launchpad or from the application folder in OS X and that app isn't already located in the dock, then the app will disappear from the dock upon closing it. I'm going to give you an example right here. I'm going to launch the App Store app and notice at the bottom of the dock it appears. Now guess what happens when I close this application. I'm just going to use the little X button in the upper left hand corner of the application and the app disappears from the dock. Now that's the desirable result if you only run that app occasionally, but for apps that you launch all the time or run all the time, it may be best to keep that app as a permanent fixture in the dock. And I'm going to show you how to do that right now. So first of all, I'm going to launch the App Store app again. All right, so it's launched. Now there are actually two ways that I can make the most often used apps or the apps that I want to keep in the dock stay there permanently until I manually remove them. And the first way is just to right click on the app that is in the dock and then go to options and then select keep in dock, just like that. Now, when I close this application, you'll notice that it stays in the dock because I've instructed it to stay in dock or keep in dock. You can see that when I right click, go to options. Now, there is also another way to make an application stay. I'm gonna show you this right now. So we're gonna launch the App Store app again, all right? Now the other way to make it stay is just to drag it to a different location in your dock uh, because it assumes it's, it's assuming that if you drag that application in your dock, you're moving it. Obviously you want it to be a permanent fixture there. Um, so I'm going to do that right now. So I'm just going to drag it up one level. And when I do that, watch what happens when I close it out. It still stays there because keep in dock is now selected and enabled. Uh, but if I want to remove this, all I need to do is select remove from dock like this and it goes away. So those are two easy ways to keep an application in your dock, even when you close it out. You can either right click on it and select keep in dock from the options section, or you can just drag it to a different location in your dock and it will automatically enable that keep in dock option. Now, if you want an application to be removed from the dock, you can see this uh, photos app, it's not running right now, but it's still in my dock. So all you need to do is go to options after right clicking and select remove from dock. The other way to remove an application from the dock is to just drag it out of the dock like this and then release. So there's two ways to actually keep an app in your dock and there's two ways to actually remove that application that I just showed you. So hopefully this was able to help you out. If you're a new user to Mac OS X, then uh, maybe you weren't aware of this or even if you're an old hat, maybe uh, one of those options you weren't totally aware of. Whatever the case may be, this will be definitely helpful for noobs and maybe even seasoned users alike. So folks, let me know what you guys think down below in the comment section. This is Jeff with iDownloadBlog.